Hello everybody. I am so excited. I just got my Duna delivered to my door. So I want to share the unboxing with everybody. And uh, yeah, let's just get started. Let's get to it. Okay, that is really not that heavy. I mean, maybe because I'm pregnant it's a little heavy, because I have to hold it awkward, like, you know, because I have my belly, but... vehicle seat protector. Hey, not bad. Better than nothing. You know, there's a lot of companies that sell seat protectors they're like made of hard plastic and they're they're really nice but expensive. That's actually really amazing that they give you that. At least you have something. This was um, attached to it. Little pamphlets that usually come with stuff like this. User guide. And uh, this is saying thank you. Our story. It shows you all the different accessories that you can get. I'm not really sure exactly if I'll be purchasing anything else. Let's see what it's got. An all day bag, an insect net. They actually do have a more heavy duty seat protector. A travel bag, snap on storage, rain cover, wheel covers, and essentials bag. I'm not sure I would really purchase anything else. And here we see really simple, easy to follow directions on how to unfold it and fold it back. Let me just check and make sure in the user guide there's not anything I need to do first.
and it, it holds um, children that weigh between 4 to 35 pounds and have a height of 32 inches or less. Four to thirty-five pounds. I mean, that's a good car seat, I would say. My son is um, going to be five. He's always been tall and skinny, and he's somewhere around forty pounds. He's probably a little bit bigger than that now, but I mean, this is going to last several years. I mean, it still depends on how big this other kid is, but. Um, but still, I think that's pretty good. It might not be, it not, it might not be as long as you could have some other car seats. But I would say, you know, r uh, really, anyway, once my son got to um, a certain, certain age with strollers, anyway, I just used the little umbrella strollers. They're very lightweight. They're really easy for kids to get in and out of. Um, so as far as like needing it for a stroller, you know, past when the kid is like getting around 30, 35 pounds, I don't think it's really necessary. Um, I don't have a problem with with how long this is gonna last. I think it's worth it still. This is saying that it's a bamboo charcoal fiber. What else does it say on there? Uh, I'll just read it. Antibacterial, hypoallergenic, humidity regulating, and thermal regulating. So. It, and sustainable. So. Oh my gosh. It's like really soft too. I'm going to go ahead and take this part off. This was located right along here. And it's telling you um, how to install it with or without the base. So that's actually really awesome. I didn't know that, that you can install it without the base. You know, that comes in handy if um, I'm out you know, shopping, doing errands, or something, and for whatever reason I'm in a place where I can't get back to my car and I need a ride, that's awesome that I know I could safely install my child in their car seat in somebody else's vehicle if it came down to a situation where I really needed somebody else to give us a ride, you know, who knows, like what if my car runs out of gas or something, that's awesome, that's really, really awesome. This is like a nice, thick canvas material, too. I really like this. It does not feel cheap at all. Like, none of these materials are cheap. This is really, really high quality. I feel like scooting this closer so you guys can see it a little bit better. This part is so ridiculously soft, too. This is amazing. Very, very comfortable. Super easy to do those clips. The 
says, in the vehicle, always rotate handles against the seat back. Oh my goodness. And this is nice too, it comes with these little shoulder straps that go right here. You see that? Usually you have to buy those separate when you get a car seat. And actually it's awesome with these, it has snaps instead of Velcro. Because I've found that there's a lot of them that have Velcro and it, it, it like will poke out the sides sometimes and actually rub against children's necks. So that's really, really smartly designed. Okay, I'm nervous to actually try to unfold it because I'm not sure how to do it exactly. But here's not here's going nothing. I mean, I need to figure it out. Okay, so this right here is what you're going to push to release the wheels. Let's try it. Do I have to do this? See, that's the problem. I don't know if I need to have the handlebar up or not. Yes, I think you do. Okay, so that handlebar always has to be pointing up, and I think you just push this button. Nope. Got two white buttons on the side. That's too far forward, I think. Right here. You want it to be right here. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, you, it's like showing that you pull it up. So you do both at the same time. Okay, that's what I'm doing wrong. You have to push this button down too. Oh my goodness. That is really easy. When you know what you're doing, it's easy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let me move all this stuff around so y'all can get a better view. Oh my gosh. I love this. I'm in heaven right now. Like, this is revolutionary to me. After dealing with, like, ridiculously heavy, bulky um, car seats that cost hundreds of dollars that, you know, this is just blowing my mind right now. This is amazing. Now how do you get it to go down? <laughs> okay, to fold, push the button, press up. Okay, and it's actually showing you kick in the wheels. You have to tuck the wheel, get the wheels like started by tucking them in. Okay. That's not that bad. Alright, and I'll show you guys. Well, I'll have to practice it a little bit to get more graceful. Because when the baby's in there, I don't want it to be jolting baby around. But this is, I'm, I can't believe how easily it's turning. Just ridiculous, like in w with one hand, even. It's so smooth. This is amazing. And then, of course, you can raise the bar, move it back and forth. 
not sure how how do I get this part to go up higher. So I know that that part goes up higher too. Okay, I think I missed it. Okay. Oh, to extend the handle, I think you have to have it lower. Once I know what I'm doing, it's actually ridiculously simple. This is amazing. I can't believe how easy and lightweight this is. I think this is my favorite purchase that I've made this time around, having the second baby. There's no way I was going to get one of those big bulky stroller Parsi combinations. As a single parent with two children, there's no way. What I really liked about this too is in this position, it's actually low enough that my son, who's gonna be turning five next month, he's gonna absolutely love to push his brother when we go grocery shopping or you know, spend and uh, take a walk in the park, anything like that. He's gonna absolutely love pushing his baby brother around because my son already gets a huge kick out of us going to the grocery store, he insists on pushing the cart. So we always use the mini, the smaller ones, and uh, I just love that, that this goes down to this level, and he'll feel more, you know, uh, helpful and included with the baby, instead of feeling like he doesn't have a role to play or, you know, any part of it. I just love it. Well, I'm about to go downstairs and get it all like set up in my car because this whole week what I've been doing is preparing everything that I need for the hospital. I um, already d filled out my birth preferences. This is a little template from Baby Center you can print out and I went ahead and put a couple things down as a general guideline birth plan and I'm going to be packing my hospital bag this weekend but I'm also doing some artwork so it's a little crazy this just came in the mail so I last minute was just like okay I'm gonna I'm too excited I'm gonna have to check it out right now I'm so excited this is amazing and this doesn't really, I, I'm short, so this kind of height doesn't really bother me either. It's not that bad for pushing the baby. This would be more useful for me if we're going on a long walk. And I really want to get, like, probably more of a powerful stride to, for, like, exercise. A little bit something like longer, longer walks. This seems a little bit more useful if we're in a crowded area, like in the grocery store, and we have to stand in line. I absolutely am so excited. I, I can't believe it. This is a must. If you're an expecting mother, I would say you should definitely get one of these. I mean, of course, I haven't tested it out with my baby in it, but I, ca I can't even tell you how excited I am. I really can't. This is amazing. I can already tell that I just am not going to regret this. I don't think I would regret it for a second because I've had to deal with those big bulky 
strollers and for spending hundreds of dollars on one I just remember that we got tired of using the stroller attachment it was just such a pain in the butt it was so heavy it was way heavier than this entire thing combined and that was without the car seat attached to it and then you had to unfold it which was uh, difficult to do it took up a lot of space we had when we weren't carrying it in our car we had to carry it in or we had to store it in like a coat closet and it was huge we just like took up so much space um, turning it it did not turn very well when you were on the sidewalk it just was huge bulky heavy didn't fit places very well and the car seat itself was in my opinion a lot heavier than this one maybe it wasn't but it just seemed like it I remember it was like awkward to hold because there was really only one way you could hold it we got one that had this like Z handle which actually is a better handle on things like that and you just really had to hold it like this and then the entire thing was like you know under your arm and you had to hold it on the side it was just a lot of work you, you couldn't really hold it with two hands unless you were like holding it like this and walking around the store and this thing is just ridiculously huge with a baby in it it was so heavy a lot of times my fiance at the time, my son's father, I was with him, he did all of the carrying. When we needed to go to the grocery store, he would um, carry the baby in the car seat because it was just too heavy. And if we wanted to use the stroller, my fiance had to get the stroller out and set it up. And then we had to transfer the car seat, and make sure it was locked in properly. And it was just an ordeal. That's not an easy thing to do just to go to the grocery store. And I go to the grocery store all the time. This is just so amazing. This is blowing my mind right now. How simple this is. Why didn't anybody think of this sooner? It's so lightweight. It rolls extremely smooth with just one hand. I could have never done that on the other stroller that I had. Never. Even with two hands, trying to turn it, if the wheels weren't in the front, the front wheels were the ones that spun around, and then the back wheels were stationed, you know, just only went forward and backwards. If the front wheels, which it had the, it had two on either side, if they were facing this way, and you tried to push it forward, it wouldn't go. And so you'd have to kind of like readjust it and then push. Pain in the butt. Pain in the butt. This one is not like that at all. You can tell the wheels that move are in the front. It just makes so much more sense. I mean, the, the wheels that rotate, and it's just one wheel on each side. So they don't lock up. They don't get stuck in a vertical or horizontal position. This is amazing. I absolutely love it. Thank you for watching my review, my unboxing. I'm going to go set it all up in my car right now because I'm just wanting to be prepared for whatever happens. Whenever this baby is born, I'm ready, which puts my mind at ease. Almost there.